All right, everybody, welcome. Um, we're doing a variation on the same color only, and this time you're allowed to pick up to two colors to have in your team. So basically, all the pets on your team have to be from like any two colors, but you can't have more than two colors. Um, any food is allowed, and then it goes to the shop phase. Sloth is a wild card and can be on any team. Um, but yeah, like if I take Bunyip and Bluebird, I can only have green and uh, blue pets for now. Which means I can't buy any of those without selling something, so I guess I'm buying the honey. And let's be the tropical minerals. And I don't know, maybe I could have just kept rolling, because the Bunyip does benefit from that. But we would have wasted one roll, and I don't know if I'm going to find a lot of helpful tanks. Rip. Okay. Good. More. And yeah, let's, let's freeze one of these. And I guess I buy sell you instead of buying <laughs> the actual apple. Do that, we get one more roll. And that is beautiful. And you know what, I actually think I'm freezing another one, I don't mind that. We could like freeze a fish as well, but I don't think we need that many. And hopefully these trade well. I'm a little bit scared because like a 6-2 is not survivable, but you know, maybe. <laughs> I'll save. Good. Okay. Oh, both. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. I mean, I think, I think I definitely start with you. Yeah, we did find flying fish, but that's not really helpful here. Um. Let's let's go for one more and just run like a three squads. Oh God. I can't even like buy two things here. Okay. Yeah, I don't want this. I, I don't want any of that. Ghost kitten we can use. But yeah, that was... That was kind of sad. This bluebird is making me pain. Your bluebird? I feel like mine's been alright. We've like missed a couple of hits going on a like secondary bunyip, but we hit that one at least. I might combine them in next turn though, because I really don't want it to be wasted, but... At the same time, I don't know how useful that is, because... I think 10 attacks probably more than I need, and I just don't have things on my team. More blue. And yeah, let's just put that on you. Okay, so whatever goes after you is going to like guarantee a kill pretty much, so I might as well have a small attack thing there. Maybe you, because you're probably not going to survive. And yeah, the rest is pretty good, I think. Ended up not combining those, but worked out. A-team. Okay, well, you actually managed to tank something, which was nice. Not sure if it made a difference, because we actually had a lot of stuff alive there. And more Ghost Kitten. I think we definitely run it, but I don't know how useful that is. I think no more Bluebirds and those two. Those two could be good, so let's, um, let's go for that. Yo. I think we do that as well. You're going to be pretty tanky. Yeah, I don't think you're going anywhere. Let's do that, and I'm going to wait for tier 5 on the combo, I think, because I don't care so much about the stuff of the next tier unless I start pivoting. So hold on to that. I don't really want cherries, so we can probably leave that as well. And I don't know, maybe if I find another avocado next turn, I can go for that. And let's have a look at the teams. We got a full green team there. Yeah, it is a mix. I follow the yellow at the bottom. I want to say there's fewer white teams. There actually were quite a few towards the bottom. But <laughs> that might be why they're there. And okay. My team kind of sabotaged itself there by replacing the ailments. But oh well. Another toad, great. It's avocado and and another avocado? I don't want more Ghost Kitten. I guess I do stack this. I've already bought the garlic for it, and it's close to it's close to level 3. Yeah. Sure. And actually a good hit. If it's sticking around, which I'm not sure if it is, but... <laughs> better than still hitting the Bunyip, I think. White team. And the garlic is actually doing a lot of work there. 
Great, okay. And that was one of the top people too. Still on 5 HP. And turtle, I could just run that. I could always run like Turtle Microbe. I don't know if I'd want to, but <laughs> the option is there. And Crocodile, I am a big fan. Oh, sell Wolf, maybe pill Turtle onto my Toad. And then just buy the Crocodile. Yeah. I don't need more of these. I think Ambrosia is pretty good, so we can pick that up. And then, yeah, we actually... I actually don't know where I want this. I don't know how to use the Toad properly. Like, this is very likely to trigger it, but then I think the... the B after it might be kind of wasted, so... I'm just gonna leave it at the back and see how it goes. Whoa, Ambrosia, new food. Yeah, so there's a new food in the Unicorn pack. It blocks 8 damage or stops an ailment from, like, destroying your guy. I'm not sure how good it is, but I've used it a couple of times. And we live. Incredible. Um, canned food. I will be swapping a lot of things out, probably. I can see myself sticking with green at the very least, so like, T-Rex is definitely something that we're going for. But blue I'm not very committed to, so we could always pivot to some other thing later. Like, yeah, the, the gray column could be pretty good, or maybe, like... End game yellow. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, and just so you know, Ambrosia is block ailment or yeah, or eight damage once. So yeah, I did get it right. Team is actually blue and yellow, bro. Oh, good for you. Yeah, it looks like most people are using green, but there's a lot of variants outside of that. Blue octopus, both blue and yellow. No, that was just meant to be yellow. Oh, but it does fit very well into this team. Hooray. Okay, so I could level Toad. And I don't mind doing that, but I think Crocodile is the only thing that's like super never going anywhere. So let's commit to that. I do think I say goodbye to Bluebirds. And I can keep this on my team for a bit, but I don't... Yeah, I don't think I freeze the other one. I think we just keep rolling. And yeah, that is great. And lionfish and sauropods. I think I like the idea of having a lionfish. We can sell both of those and get start on that, maybe. The lemon. I could put it on there, but I don't think it's really worth a whole lot. Or I could just go for the sauropod. I don't know. Sauropod's fine as well, but yeah, if I can just get the T-Rexes, then I won't need the, the money so much. Yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it. I think next turn, double sell these, and then, you know, buy a lionfish avocado, and hopefully I won't be that much weaker. Killing you again. Yeah, you are showing me your blurring octopus. <laughs> okay, the weakness on there is going to be helpful, but... No, never mind, that was very good. I thought I was going to suffer a bit more there. Alright. So... Uh... Let's, let's wait. If I do that immediately, it's going <laughs> to really hurt. And I will buy another canned food, but show me, like, yeah, levels. There we go. One of those is nice. I don't need another can. And yeah, flashlight onto crocodile. So next turn, I can get the pivot going. I am going to be snacking Bunyip, and hopefully we'll find something worth going for. But I don't know. I might not go for the lionfish. Depends what shows up from the combos and stuff. Shouldn't you have Coast Kitten in the back to block alligator? Probably. Yeah, there are four of them. There's not that many, but there aren't that many other snipers. There's like Dolphin. So you might be right. But in a minute, it's not going to matter. Cool. Okay, so you're getting very large. Um, stack this to star, just see what we get. And we already found the T-Rex. I could go for the other lionfish, but yeah, we're definitely doing T-Rex. So, goodbye guys. Getting flashlights. You to the front now, at least for when that pops. Oh, that is beautiful. Okay, we say goodbye to Bunyip, we buy other T-Rex. We buy a lemon, probably. It'd be nicer to get melon, but I don't know if I'm selling anything to pill turtles, and you know, there's no guarantee I'm going to get it out of Cornucopia. 
And then, yeah, there's, there is Sauropod, but I'm kind of just happy with this team. So I think I just send it. <laughs> I think we just send it and keep looking for the XP. Leech Camel actually kind of working. Oh, that reminds me. Yeah, you could do um, Leech uh, Gorilla at some point. And then immediately sell the Leech. <laughs> okay. That's not looking great for me, but we have time to scale. Oh, it is great for me. Sorry, I'm just really dumb. Uh, okay, let's leave it. Like These are going to scale each other, probably, but... Yes, there's, there's this doom roll for scaling. Nah. I get the crocodile. It's like, maybe, actually, but... Uh, yeah, you know what? Okay, so if this turns into another T-Rex, we just buy the T-Rex. Yeah, if not, then hopefully this is a crocodile or something else we need. And it isn't, but whatever. Throwing Doctopus. It's like, fine. I mean, we're going to be getting rid of that anyway. But yeah, by combining my T-Rex, it is kind of helpful, because it means it's only going to hit these two. But I would like another one. Oh, they did it. Leech Camel. It's Patat. And am I dead? I am dead. Okay. <laughs> that was close. If I could have survived one hit for my Toad there, then we would have been alright. But, oh well. Another Toad. I don't know whether I want this to get to the last thing or not. I think I'm leaving it. We might go for it later, maybe, but... <laughs> There is a sauropod. We can get value out of that. Yeah, fine. Just add it to the team. It can be permanent. Make yourself fruit, tomato, pretzel. Everything except for toad is pretty high tier. Um, so yeah, let's get the Yggdrasil fruit, I think. Put down there. And then we can still buy one more food, so let's roll once. And that is worse, but oh well. <laughs> Howling cow. That is probably a better reason to get rid of Toad, actually. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of hurting a bit, but... I think we can make that work. Yellow and green, same as me. Very different team, though. Yeah, I don't know, Toad's doing good work. And if I do buy this other high-tier thing, then we're going to be spreading out the stats a lot. But, let's do it. Alright, so let's try and make you really big. The lionfish is already doing great by itself. Yes. And you know what? Freeze this one. I don't mind just buying regular stuff here. We want to buy as much food as possible to get the most um, sauropod value, but... Yeah, it's been great so far. <laughs> and excellent hits, thank you. Yeah, this team is looking great. Alright, so unless the gray team's at the top. And we have a big white team as well. I like it. Yeah. Micro Turtle too. Oh. <laughs> okay, spammy snipes maybe not the best against that team, but yeah, we're good. Good, just show me levels. I could, I could be so much stronger with levels, and that's that's like almost a level. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean we just we just buy everything. Future mortality is not in the packs. So I guess I just popcorn something. It's better than nothing. I'm definitely not compatoing. And if even if I stack that, it doesn't do anything. So um, yeah. And oh my god. All right, just. What? Buy these two? Because they're the, they're the closest to levels that kind of matter. I don't know, maybe I could have done that one over Highland Cow, but... Yeah, getting the Lionfish leveled up would be very nice. Yeah, I like that. Wait, <laughs> it's double leech! I didn't even see. I also need to watch out, because there is a giant raccoon somewhere. One. Yo. Okay, I was going to complain about my, my luck there, but I actually also had really good breakpoints afterwards. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Pitta bread could be pretty great. How big are people's front lines? Not as big as mine, but yeah, it might screw me up with a raccoon. But I think it's worth going for anyway. We'll just um put that down there. 
on you, but yeah. Get starters, and those are levels. Okay, one more trigger on you, so I can buy a cornucopia and then level both of these up, which is amazing. Chicken leg, probably. Um, yeah, let's see what these are. Okay, well, didn't need the other one, but we are kind of close to level 3 T-Rex. Hopefully that'll make a difference. I don't know if there's enough time to do it. But yeah, it looks alright. What tier are all of my pets? Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> they are all high tier now. I forgot I sold the, the toad. I think I had locked in on that not being that useful, but yeah, my mistake. And what now? I still need to buy food. Or at least I want to. Okay, well... Uh, I don't even know. Buy one of each. If we manage to find another level, like buy chocolates or something, then we get pretty good value. So let's have that ready for it. And if I can get the last of your HP from some other source so it doesn't waste another T-Rex, that'd be kind of nice. But yeah, T-Rex can literally hit anything, so... I don't know whether I'm lucky or unlucky that it keeps hitting the lionfish. Save. Alright. I'm sorry, Sky. Chicken leg, yeah. Alright, keep putting that on there, and then we roll. Yeah, I mean, I think I just keep buying stuff. Hey, <laughs> double chocolate. Okay. So, I can't actually get the most value out of Sauropod, but I still think I dump one of those onto there and then, I don't know, probably level T-Rex and then roll away the rest of my money. There's really, like, no time left, but I still want to level the T-Rex. Is that or I do just go super hard on Lionfish, which is probably the right play, but I've got, like, one spare HP. How did you miss this? No! Uh, they're gonna summon a 50-50, and that's pretty bad. Oh my god. It was so close. I could have easily not died there. Okay, well, look, I'm doing this either way. That's happening. Ooh. No. Okay, leave the T-Rex. I'm gonna keep it frozen, but let's just level this up immediately. Um, hold on. I can roll once and buy one food. This? The cornucopia? Okay, well, we didn't get anything after that again. I'm keeping T-Rex frozen, but there's, there's no time. <laughs> so I'm probably not going to actually go for that. And... I don't even know what to do. Like, the front line is kind of scary, but we will still one-shot it, even if it steals the equipment. I don't think you can get the Great One achievement anymore. Yeah. I mean, if they... You know that wacky weekly pack where you could, um... I don't know, if you died to someone and they still had pets on their team, which, you know, is every time you die to someone, um, you could copy a pet. So you might be able to do that with the, the Bad Dog book. But I don't know if they're bringing that back or not. Orange. Cornucopia is amazing for these guys. And honestly, probably just soft dice. I could pop corn there, but we need to try and get protective equipment if it ever shows up. Melon. <laughs> Alright, better or worse? A lot worse for you. About the same for you. I can just like put it on one of my back lines, I guess. Like, that's an improvement. It's horrible. Another thing that I'm probably never going to be able to level, but, you know, maybe. Yeah, I mean, I'm probably dumping chocolates onto Crocodile next turn, because Highland Cow's still quite a ways away. Um, something I do need to do, actually, is change my positioning, because I still have T-Rex in the middle. And he is very much a backline pet, I think. Yeah, so we still have just one shot there, which is nice. And then... Ugh. Fine, actually? Absolutely fine. It was a clone, though. Okay, top two. Top two, I am doing this immediately. Oh, the T-Rex. <laughs> so I could level it up. Maybe I do just a, the visual. 
yeah, let's buy the pizza. Okay. Another one of these. Celery, lots of HP. I put on you, that's not that bad. I don't think anything else is too helpful. Yeah, let's put that there, and let's just buy everything. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, that's like one turn's worth of stats, so another 4-4. Four, four. I think that's good. So maybe you'd send it that way. We're still going to one-shot through there, so I think that's still fine. Yes. Oh god, like, everything's really high. Nah, we're fine, right? We're absolutely fine. We made it. <laughs> Alright. GG's, guys. Good game. I made it with green and yellow. Good colors. Okay, everybody, welcome. We are doing cats only in a custom pack. So on this one, when you end your turn, every pet on your team has to be a cat. So a feline thing. That is Tabby Cat, Ghost Kitten, Sphinx, um, Lucky Cat, Lynx, Chimera, Lion, Panther, and then like everything up to Manticore down here. So all food is allowed, and it goes to shop phase. You are allowed a slot as well. But yeah, these three are the earliest things you can get. And let's, let's go for you. I'm actually not sure what I was doing, freezing the ducklings. <laughs> but, yeah. Alright, so, can't use these, they are not cats, but I can sell them for three rolls. I could also combine them here, and there is a chance I'll be able to find another one. But I think instead, I just roll once, and then... I was hoping I'd see another one, or a mouse or something. Hmm... Let's combine. It's more fun. And it's missed. <laughs> okay, so I lost a roll by doing that, but that's not that much worse. The most important thing is to change postures relatively often. Any posture for too long wrecks you. Yeah, that's fair. I don't know, streaming's just weird because I end up... I don't know, because I can sit in the same spot for hours if I'm gaming or something, or editing videos. Oh my god, that's a dream shop. Um, but yeah, as soon as I'm kind of locked in, like, if I stream or I'm in a cinema or something, that really destroys my legs for some reason. I think I don't do any of the, like, micro-movements you normally do. Okay, well, we didn't get anything off the rolls, but that, that was an amazing start. And any early things? One tabby? Yo, a couple more. Okay, we got, like, a handful of early things there. Alright, time to go Lioness. Hey, if you get it early enough, then it would be amazing. And how did you have such a big tabby? <laughs> Why was it so healthy? Buff them. Good. Uh, well, I'm not buying another one on the same thing. I can maybe buy a Lima, or buy sell Lima, and then, you know, put on one of these at the front, but... I'm kind of tempted to just buy more cherries. Or not, yeah, let's do the Lima. Let's see that because I'm probably going to combine these kind of soon and then put garlic on it. So, might as well just make something really survivable. And yeah, if I'm going to combine everything, then broccoli is going to be very nice as well. So let's send that. Combine three ducklings on turn two. <laughs> okay, okay, that was kind of what I was going for at the start. And then I thought against it, because I actually don't normally do combinations right at the start, but... Yeah. It paid off, apparently. It's called Mouse and Broccoli. I need to buy some more mice. This is actually pretty good. Obviously when you get to Salable and stuff, it's not quite as amazing, but... Yeah, you can make some very large things. Cool. It's a rabbit. I'm actually kind of tempted to buy that temporarily. Because I can buy that and then buy both of these and sell it again. Let's do it. Oh my god, I hit the thing again. Ugh. Okay, just put that one on there then, and then let's again leave. And food dog. No, I will buy sell this guy though. You're really strong, we can have you at the back. And then, yeah, I'm gonna freeze Avocado, because I need to push money forward. I feel like Lucky Cat just isn't very good. I should probably put the, um, the Gingerbread Man in here, but... Lynx is great, Chimera is not... Panther and Lion can be, but it, you know, varies. And then it's all the tier 6s that are just amazing all the way through. 
Actually, maybe this is pretty good. Like, a high-level Ghost Kitten actually does tank a lot of damage. Like, you know, if someone's going for Leopard Lynx, then this could be good. Food Dog looks like a cat. I know what you mean, but it is called a dog, so... Yeah, I don't think it's... I don't think it's really there. Hey. Alright. Oh, I can't do everything I want, actually. I was hoping I could buy-sell everything here, but that... That doesn't work. Alright. You can't add Tabby. Um, I'm gonna freeze the Tabby, because getting the combo will be helpful. But I'm just gonna roll the other guy. And... Garlic? Is Garlic enough? I still feel like these things are really tiny, and they're just kind of likely to get one shot. So it might be better to just put bananas on them or something. And Griffin is technically a cat due to it being half lion. It's not in here, right? Oh, it's the bottom half. Okay. <laughs> I see what you're saying, but I'm way more tempted to put in the top half of a, a cat in as a cat than this guy. Like, this is just a bird. It's a bird with some, like, cat legs. Chimera, too. Yeah, well, I, I put Chimera on the left side because it is just a lion. Like, it's very similar to the lion. And how is everybody so big? <laughs> what are they doing right? Okay, maybe should have done something with that, actually. And, yeah, stack you by this as it is. Chimera. And, again, there's just, like, no... There's no mana. So I will not touch it. Let's do this. I'm waiting on combining these for tier 6, because, again, don't really care about tier 5. It's decent stats, but if you get an early Lioness or a cat, then you can really start going a bit crazy. So we'll just do that and then dump the... The thing on there next turn, I think. Okay, didn't hit that, <laughs> which is great. I do kind of like having a full team of um, ghost kittens, but... Yeah, I don't know how safe they are. Alright, so you're probably not going anywhere. We can do this. And this guy one getting summoned at the end, but I think I'm going to roll these. So yeah, my options are buying another pair for the Lynx, or just rolling for more, more levels. And I think I'd rather the levels, because we can find a Crow, we can find a Lynx, we can find Tabby Cat. Like, there are a handful of things that'd be helpful. I could freeze both of these. <laughs> I might be doing that as well, so sure. Oh. Wait, how, wait, how do I do this? Because next turn I'm combining these two together, so I will have two spaces, so I don't think I can, like... Buy, sell all these separately and get even more combos by combining ducks and beavers. So I probably just like triple buy and then sell. It's going to cost me a lot more money, but I do get to see a tier 6 that way. Oh. Well. 2 HP. We need to make a comeback. Combine. Buy, sell, 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 buy, sell, I sell, buy, sell, 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 what? I'm not even going to pretend I understand what that is. Okay. Yeah, so I, I do think I'm going to um do these. I don't know, because I, I could get rid of something and then I could just like combine all the ducks or something instead, and then it's way more, way more cheap that way. Plus, I can actually get a lot more stats from the same two tiger. But, yeah, I won't. Let's just, let's just do this. And we did find a black cat. That's pretty nice. Okay, so do that. Sell you by cat. Freeze chocolates. Probably freeze them in as well, and then dump down dead ASAP. And maybe just sell the tabby. I don't know. It'd be nice if I could get some snap food, but I'm not unfreezing these. So, yeah, we'll just we'll just send that. You got twenty twenty line without ability. Where are people getting the stats from? Like you don't even have the scalers yet. Okay, well, I am feeling better now. Now that I have a cat and a, a saber tooth, like, I might be able to stabilize a bit. Okay, so do that. Do this, and then... I don't know, I can maybe freeze that. Okay, do this. Save sushi for next turn. That is a leopard, which is amazing. And then, yeah, I think I sell tabby, buy sell zebra, buy leopards, sushi next turn. Yeah, I think. <laughs> That seems fine. I'm also going to keep the blobfish frozen in case I do find a pill somehow, but yeah. 
And yeah, there's the 2020 lion. All right, we do have a lioness. So I'm hoping they're not going to be able to go insane. Because if those teams manage to survive for several rounds, then they might end up with, like, yeah, just terrifying teams. He stole Puma from someone. Oh, so is that, um, like, Stingray stats? Oh my god. Okay, Sky's gonna get some crazy scaling there. He's almost dead, but... Yeah, two Pumas, one at level two, and has a toy about to trigger. It's spooky. Yeah. Alright, I think we say goodbye to that, then. Oh, Lioness. <laughs> Do I? Puma Puma, Ghost Kitten. I don't know if I'm going to die. I could sell Ghost Kitten and then play Lioness, but then I'm going to be a lot smaller. I don't think I don't think I commit to that. I think I do just um food scale the rest of the way. Otherwise it's kinda very risky. Alright, this I don't know. Let's do it that way. You're on a hot streak, but you're sure you're gonna fall off. I'm kind of on the opposite. I had like a little losing streak and now I'm just praying that I'm not gonna suddenly <laughs> explode. I feel alright though. Like my team isn't that much worse than what I'm looking at here. And that at the front. I forgot how it changed. Oh my god. Right. Okay, well you need to be there. <laughs> um I guess I just double this and then buy the this stuff. I can't really do a whole lot more here. And yeah, I'm gonna keep buying buying lemons. I'm gonna leave the potato even though it's, you know, about the same. Twice, twice. Yeah, it's just lemon's nicer. It does protect from slightly less, but you know, it can also protect you from things just bumping into it, which is more likely at the moment, I feel. Yeah, who knows? I may just be dead soon. I don't know, maybe if I do find a white tiger, I should go for that. The only issue is it'd be a lot smaller than things I have, so it'd only really work with the saber tooth. Please let Gina survive so I can be on his YouTube. Yes. Yes, so let me live. Only for that reason. Uh... I don't think it's gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, I am dead. Oh god, if only I had more time. Like, the level 2 cat and level 2 leopard, that could have just been enough by itself if I had um, bought more food, but... I bought, like, two sushis <laughs> in the time I had these. Oh well. Alright, well, GG's. Good luck to everybody still going in that one.